Hello guys, please be sure to join the notification squadron by clicking the notification bell next to the subscribe button underneath the, this video. By doing so, we'll make sure you never miss an upload. That is all. <laughs> hey guys, Cool Bowser here. Welcome back to Cool Bowser X. And joining me today... Golden Warrior 72. Reactions plays the Animal Diffusion King. And today we are reacting to... Another stroke of the Lyrish. Depends on what type of stroke it is. <laughs> I just gotta resist. It can, it can either be the one. It, it can be the one you have in your heart. In your, you know what? Yeah. The video is by the Inverted Shadow. And if anyone watching has not seen this video yet, please pause the video and click the link down in the description to go watch the original video before watching our reaction. Guys, doing so really helps out the original uploader of the video. Mm-hmm. Please support the creator. Start this reaction now. Looney Tunes. Yep. Yep. Depends on what kind of stroke! Uh huh. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> I am heavy weapons. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Ah, oh, you bad titties! Why? Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Oh yeah, something I should mention, the guy who was talking on the team is the, is the YouTuber. Yeah. Yeah. Very disturbing. Yeah. Isn't that from the FNAF 3 minigame? Yeah, it looks like it. Please tell me you were watching the news just now. Yep, yep. They were just talking about you and a pair of damaged suits that were holding the corpses of two serial killers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, fine. Whatever. The suits. What did they say? The Why did they have the this suits? pony with a male voice? They said they were just taking them out of the pizzeria. I don't think they would be able to make a different smile again. Ugh. Could be. I just came back <laughs> to that place to try and get a look at those things myself. But those lunkheads won't let me through. Even though I was the one that proved they were holding killers in a kitty's pizza joint. Uh, the statement does not register. Elaborate. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> That's what Lyra took up that night shift. How could you not know that happened? I was brought into creation by a weird marionette thing. Self has no knowledge of prior engagements in Freddy Fazbear's. Bon Bon, what exactly are you talking about? Oh, fine. I didn't want to tell you this, but since RoboU brought it up, I'll spill it. Do you remember when I took up that night guard position at Faz Pies 30 years ago? Oh, yeah! It was that long ago? Holy shit! Home, you said you'd never volunteer for night jobs again! That's beside the point. See, what I didn't tell you was all the fracas that went down during that job. Those kitty robots the ads mentioned? They all came to life in the midst of my shift and tried to rip my face off, like they tried to do to you! <gasps> Did they also send out a robotic version of yourself to try and tear your skin off and pose as you?! What?! No, my <laughs> it wasn't any of your shift. <laughs> Oh, okay. Uh, anyways, no, it wasn't until the end of my shift that I bumped into the culprits. These weird-looking girls. One of them was a magician, so I can only imagine she was the one that was making the robots go cuckoo. But the other? I don't know what was up with her, but she looked straight up insane. And that red eye of hers? Ugh. 
Why would two girls want to mess with a children's pizzeria? Why should it matter? They were trying to kill me! Anyways, it was only a few years after I was fired when things took a really bad turn. I went back to the pizzeria to try and explain why those pony bots had malfunctioned, but the guy wouldn't believe me. I tried so hard to stick to that story, but all he did was thank me for giving them a reason to refurbish the older animatronics. Jackass! Prick. Seriously? Yeah. He said he had to go to the back. Yeah, what a dick! To one of the suits, <laughs> and he left me there just wondering why I took that job in the first place. Uh, That'd be a good so question. The money and you really love me? Gay? Remind me. Anyways. An hour or so went past, and the guy just wasn't giving me any sign he was still there. So I decided to go into that back room myself, totally unaware I was being watched by those two girls. Guess they came back to try and finish what they started. Things weren't made any better when the first thing I saw in that back room was the man in one of those horrible springlock suits. No doubt waiting for me, and evidently so was that red-eyed girl. Because when I turned around, there she was in the old Sunset Shimmer suit again with her accomplice right over her. I honestly thought Isn't I that spring dying. body? Yeah. I yeah. Guess maneuvering in those suits was more of an ordeal than I thought. Ah -ha! Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit! Holy... Yeah, I wasn't expecting that! Holy crap! <laughs> Not intentionally. I didn't know they would go off like that. Either way, I thought my hooves were clean of this whole mess until you took up that Celestia Forsaken night shift and came back with this thing! <laughs> so, what's the big deal then? None of us died! That's not the point, Lyra. I know I said those suits took care of those murderers, but I don't know. I feel like something still needs to be done. And now we're in Fast Rush Freight. Yep, that what it looks like. One of the hardest finance price games ever. Oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say I, I probably got scared of the shit was when that happened. Yeah, what the fuck? Trap. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know, but why? I never have to hear about oh. that stupid Fazbear's joint again. In other news, to mark this rather gruesome milestone, a new attraction is looking to keep the Fazbear name alive. The establishment, dubbed Fazbear's Fright, appears to be a sort of haunted house attraction dedicated entirely to the many relics the children's pizza franchise left behind closed doors. Ranging from faulty animatronic parts to old crayon drawings, this new attraction looks set to bring back your childhood in the worst possible way. Oh yeah, how wonderful! <laughs> Another night. 
nice. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the interaction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works. They're not even phone calls, they're pre-recorded calls. Yeah, just get comfortable with the new setup. Yeah. You can check the security cameras over to your right with the click of that blue button. Uh, you can toggle between the hall cam, the vent cam, uh, then over to your far left, uh, you can flip up your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any systems that may go offline. The most important thing you want to watch for is the Man, you cheap asses! This place will give you the spook, man. Don't afford to actually place, good ventilation, you really? You'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air blowing. Uh, when the place opens, people will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you, then past you, and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially... That sounds like these people don't give a fuck. Uh, you'll be starring yep. as... the security guard. So not only will Whoop you be... do But you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. But I have an even better surprise for you. <laughs> You're not gonna believe this. We found one. A real one. Really? Uh, uh, gotta go, man. Uh, well, well look, it, it's in there somewhere. I'm, I'm sure you'll see it. Talk to you later, man. There not cool, dude. Bond is here with us? Yeah, oh. that is not oh, good. Maybe the next few hours won't be so bad after all. <laughs> uh, Lyra? So far, I'm not finding anything on these cameras. Shit! Oh boy. I don't think the guy on the phone mentioned two robots, did he? Knowledge of past recording says no! <laughs> oh no! We're trapped! Yikes! What? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Fuck you, boy! <bull> boy. <laughs> nah. The demon spawn of a hell child! <laughs> Fucking arrangement, child! <laughs> yeah. Gary's Mall. <laughs> every time, every time something dangerous comes up, she just has to take it. Isn't there some level of common sense in that head of hers to tell her that something is wrong? I mean, it's bad enough I don't know where this stupid Fazbear horror place is. Uh, huh. Look, are you done? Also, those two Splatoon characters, the, past the, eight the, minutes, the boy one is actually the YouTuber as well. And the female one is his girlfriend. Kids pizzeria anyway. Come on, lady. I don't understand what your gripe is with a place for kids. My gripe is that I seem to be the only one that cares that my friend roommates locked herself right to a death trap. <laughs> one that she probably doesn't even realize at all has to do with me. Excuse me, miss. Sorry to bother you, but I couldn't help but notice you were talking about Freddy Fazbear's. Yeah? What's it to you? Oh, nothing. It's just that my friend and I were interested in all the horror stories surrounding the place. Or we were. She's gone missing for years now, and I haven't been able to track her down since. Well, that's a shame. But why are you talking to me? I'm just trying to find my roommate, not hear your life story. Well, actually, I think you'll want to listen to me. I want so badly to reunite with my friend as you do with yours, and I won't stop until I'm by her side again. Actually, <laughs> I think you might be a bigger help to me than you might think, Bon Bon. How did you know my name? Oh, it was more than a lucky guess. However, little pony, I think the bigger question is, do you remember me? How could I possibly know who you are? This is literally the first time you've approached me. Is it really? Try thinking back a bit. To that one night in 1987, Pinky
Kentucky Faz Pies Pizza. Long before the Fazbear Band was ever a thing, you took up that faithful position. <laughs> oh, no. Uh -oh. no. No, you can't be! But I am. <laughs> the great and magnificent Magic Man returns. <laughs> no, 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 this isn't happening! This isn't happening! Oh, but it is, and you're not done with me yet. <laughs> Seriously, just everyone sat there! <laughs> it didn't even scream or anything, really? <laughs> Trolling him. Oh, Were there phantoms? you did to my friend Shimmer Cakes. Ah! Okay, first of all, Shimmer Cakes? Really? What kind of a stupid name is that? Second, are you seriously talking about what happened at Freddy's with that red-eyed girl and that child murderer? Yes. If it weren't for you, Shimmer would stay. Are you sure it wasn't child molester? Instead, she's been trapped inside that stupid spring lock suit for all these years. Oh, come on! I only did what I could to... Wait, what did you just say? What do you mean? You actually thought she was dead? That takes more than a bunch of metal contraptions going right through her body to stop her. I know that for a fact. Whoa. That's actually kind of freaky. Anyways, answer me this then. Why did you and that... Uh, shimmer Cakes girl even decide to crash my night shift 30 years ago? I mean, I know you're both completely insane, but you've got to have at least some reason. And that we did. We had simply heard of the stories about a group of children going missing and subsequently dying inside one of those Freddy Fazbear's pizzerias. Our curiosity had been piqued for a while, and when we heard that a spin-off joint named Pinky Faz Pies had opened up, we wondered if the rumors about the animatronic mascots being the murderers had carried over to the new location. 
And lo and behold, who just happened to be the unlucky sap that got the job on the night we made our move. So of course, you made the perfect bait for all of them. Until we saw that you were smarter than you looked. You honestly thought I was just gonna sit there in my office and let them eat me? I'm not as stupid as my fr roommate is. Thanks for being a buzzkill regardless, idiot. So, you say your friend can survive some real heavy stuff, huh? Yes. Shimmer Cakes is incredibly resilient to pain. You know, she was once frozen solid and blasted with a hand cannon and barely croaked. Wow. Pretty high threshold she has. Oh, why do you even care? She's my friend, not yours. Hey, I was only curious. You said that springlock suit she took didn't kill her. I was just thinking maybe if she survived, then... Why so scared? Oh of shit! That? If your friend was able to survive getting crushed by that suit, what about the other guy? <laughs> You're right. Oh my yeah, gosh, we forgot about so purple weird. guy. What happened with those suits after what happened? The only thing I know is what I saw in the news. They took both suits out of the old pizzeria, but I don't know what became of them. Those Fazbear people can't be completely gone, right? <gasps> Wait a minute. There is something. That place that opened up recently! Fazbear's Fright! Oh, you mean that horror attraction that had all the old junk from those Freddy Fazbear pizzerias? Yeah, I tried to stop my roommate from working there, but she slipped out before I could stop her. And I really don't get how she could have fallen for such an obvious death trap! Well, it was- WE EXPECT SHE'S RETARDED! On all the negative yeah! Pizzerias got. She's in the all haunted the place, for God's sake. Who could blame the guy that opened and the plus, place up? Mm -hmm. And plus, oh, her, her other stuff is, is also a retard. Is having an actual live animatronic. No, you don't think that they got Shimmer and that killer in there? Myra really is stuck in a death trap. We gotta do something. But Shimmer doesn't know anything about. Wait, what do you mean we? What? You really think I'm gonna go there myself? I don't even know where it is. Well, I know where it is. I actually bothered to read the ads in the papers about it. But what makes you think I can help you out? You want your friend Shimmer back, right? Then let me make you a proposition. You take us to Fazbear's Fright. We find our respective friends and deal with those two buckets of bolts. And we all go our separate ways once it's all said and done. Truce? <sighs> For now. Help me get Shimmer out of that awful springlock suit, and maybe we'll spare you after we all get out. You have my word. Now let's get moving. Who knows how Lyra's dealing with those killers right now? I can't believe they're actually working together. Yeah, that's I'm weird. Get the rubber hose, loser. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they're still trolling them. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking druggie! <laughs> A place of joy and friendship mm -hmm. is now a dirty mm -hmm. the puppet talking over with yeah. the blood of the innocent. Thanks to my friends and I, though, some not so innocent blood has been shed here as well. Now we act as guardians, protectors over this blasphemous place. survived 30 years of secrecy, isn't it? But besides the point, we've got to find Shimmer. And Lyra. Whatever, let's just get to looking. I don't think we have to. They found her! Are you the one who needs to die? Well, it really doesn't matter. You are here of your 
your own free will, which means that you are not innocent, and we only spare those who are innocent. For you, however, I believe that suffering would do good things for your soul. No. Your soul. By stepping foot in this that place, was creepy. you yeah, surrendered your right to live. Now die. Oh, jeez. Please don't tell me I'm too late! <sighs> Did you ever think for a moment that I can't run as fast as you can? Oh, stuff it, will you? Lyra's gotta be here! <gasps> Alright, too late. Where's my friend, you rusty old junk heaps? She's your friend? You seriously didn't pick up on that? <gasps> Oh, jeez. No. no! I can't be too late! I can't! Why don't you freaks do to her?! Don't you remember? Oh, I remember you. And I know you remember me. I know you fear what you have made. What you have become. I know you fear me. You can't outrun your fears, your actions, your choices. All you can do is hide. But in the end, you will suffer like so many others already have. <laughs> what? Huh? What the hell? her robot counterpart! She's still alive?! You don't belong in that suit! Oh my! You idiot! You left me to rot in that infernal suit for 30 years! Do you even realize how much we've lost in that time span? No, no. Toy Shimmer, has it all been in vain? I was able to get something done in your time span from that death trap. And what could you possibly mean? <gasps> you. You're the pony that put me in that suit in the first place! Uh, it wasn't my fault! You and the other guy were just being careless wearing those things! So it's your I... fault all this happened! How dare you accuse me like that? If it weren't for your meddling, I would have achieved the greater power I so deserve. Is something wrong? Uh -oh. uh, don't let it get me, Shiver, please! I'll forget you two! I've got to get out of here with what's left of my friend! Hello? Is there someone out there? Ah! Lyra! Bon Bon! Fire! What? What? No, really? Wow! Oh, let me tell you, Bon Bon! Uh, uh, should you really be talking about this? Why are the buildings burning? Robo me got me out of that bunny suit's grip, and it knocked me right into the vents where she and I were able to escape. That's awfully convenient. Right, whatever. I'll be joined about that later. We gotta get out of here before we're all fried to a crisp. I'll do it. Everyone, gather around me. I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh, will you shut up, Shiver? They're actually helping us. <laughs> almost ripped Lyra's face off when you two first met, but you're not a killer like they were! Don't you get it? Every one of those animatronics owes its life to that puppet! It's the one that made them all like this! Mm. It made me like this! I carry the Fazbear curse just as much as they do! What are you saying? If they all burn, I deserve to burn with them! What?! Don't say that! You aren't like them anymore! But I am! The world is safer without another robot like me hurting children! Freddy Fazbear's is where I was created! 
Mika may be annoying, and someday she might just be the very bane of my existence. And the day she brought you home from that night shift, I thought my life just ended right there. And to an extent, it did. Having two of her in the house can be insufferable. But at the same time, well, you've made her happy. And as much as she still irritates me to no end, I'd hate to see you leave us. Do I really make you happy? Well, yeah. Ever since we left that pizzeria, it's like I have two friends now. And I always wanted another me. I'm your friend. Forget who made you. You can leave that past behind. Come and start a new life with the two of us. You won't regret it. Alright, they all escaped. It's finally over. Hmm. Oh, look. In the long run, maybe it wasn't worth chasing a pony like you in a kitty's pizza place of all things. I'd hope I'd discover something from it, but well, you saw what happened. So uh how about we just pretend what happened 30 years ago never happened, and we all go our separate ways. The more I can forget about being trapped in that awful suit, the better. Come on, Magic Mare. We've got a lot of lost power to regain, and there's a whole world of idiots just waiting for us. Now, Magic Mare! Hmm. Hmm. Ugh, finally. I am so done with all this Freddy Fazbear stuff. Uh, maybe now I can finally get a good night's sleep. Yeah, I don't think so. Ah, uh, why is that, Ray? Okay, now I see why! <laughs> Never mind! What the hell? What? It's the Nightmare in A. Hello. You're not afraid, are you? What? Well, maybe we should change that. Get no! Absolutely friggin' no! <laughs> I'm dealing with you and your killer friends! You wanna mess with someone? Take it up with my friend and her robot pet! I'm done! <laughs> that was hilarious! Everybody does. And we have all night to figure out just what you're afraid of. So let's dig. Remember that clone that, they, that we didn't see at Bon Bon? Yeah. There she is. He's including. Yeah. All right, the uh, video ended there, guys. Uh, what did you th think of it? Well, what I thought of the video was that it was awesome, had great animation, but why did Springtrap have to show his, his bloody rapey face? Yeah, oh Jesus, why? <laughs> Alright. Oh, so, Alright, 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 let's finish this. Uh, what did you think about it, Golden? It was pretty good, but why does Springtrap have to show his face? Ugh. Yeah, he has a very horrifying face. <laughs> and also kind of rapey with those eyes. Yes. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> it, was, it was pretty funny, hilarious. It was pretty awesome, honestly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What I like oh. most is the voice acting. Yeah, something I should mention is that the the two the three ponies they were voiced by the same character. Uh, you mean by the same actor, right? Yeah. Yeah, and uh, oh. also also the the person who voiced that uh the girl the girl inside the that was inside the horse animatronic. Uh, she also does a lot of uh, voice acting on her channel. Hmm. So, yeah, that's cool. So, what did you think of it, Bowser? Well, I thought it was hilarious, funny, and also kind of fucked up. 
Uh, especially well when they show uh, yeah. showed the one crazy girl and uh, and the purple guy being brutally murdered. Holy shit! Lots of plot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know, you, you know what was, was kind of also bad. They had a drug addict animatronic. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 uh, yeah. Just, uh, just uh, some some coke. <laughs> Speaking of which. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> for our reaction. Thanks so much for watching and if you enjoyed please be sure to hit the like button. It does help out the channel a lot and uh, we'll see you next time guys. Have a nice day. See ya. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Gotta snort the anus cocaine. <laughs> Why? 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 <laughs>